Ha, it's Kepi. I apologize for the delay, but Kepi just arrived home from a long trip to Russia. What for did I go there, you ask? It is actually a long story, but having lots of time for my cinnamon buns, let's get comfy so I can tell you about these last three days I got absent. After releasing my debut video, I received a message saying I left behind at the shrine the latest desire to realize it happened to be of a kind Russian babushka. This babushka only wishes for company and someone to whom cook her delicious dishes. So Kepi got motivated to visit her in person to accomplish all her wishes. It was more difficult than she expected, given how this babushka loves cooking. She made me try all kinds of Russian dishes, such as borscht, kartoshka, bini, piroshki. Borscht is a sour soup made mainly of beetroots that give that nice red color to the soup. Kartoshka, well, they just regular potatoes, but Mother Russia's potatoes surely taste particularly good. Blini could be the Russian version of pancakes, and finally piroshki are... Russian baked buns with various fillings. In my case, the babushka made them using meat. Babushka also told me that due to Russian cold, they usually wear varyshki, ushanka and valenki. After giving all three to me, she let me help that side with the sled in order to have fun and make Russian snowmen together with the animals from the nearby forest. So Kepi, together with her new friends, together with her new friends, decided to spend some time at the woods. The animals living at the woods told me that there is another Russian superstition that says if you go into the woods and loudly ask Cuckoo, you can find out how many years you have to live. How many times will sing Cuckoo, so many years you have to live. So I decided to sing them a Russian song in order to thank them for this interesting story. Еще не написанных сколько? Скажи, кукушка, пропой. В городе не жители на выселках, камнем лежать и бегать свистом. Солнце мое, люби на меня. А я на дом превратилась в кулак. Если есть порох, дай огня. По следу одинокому Сильные да смелые Головы сложили в поле Баю Мало кто остался с этой памяти Трезвом мне Ты святой рукой страх Солнце 
Спасибо. While staying here, I experienced it myself what it means to experience the cold of Russia. And I also like to say that there is surely a lot of snow during winter. Kippy loves snow because it's really white and fluffy and adds this festive atmosphere. With time, I also learned that during festivities here comes Jet Maros to gift presents. But the story doesn't end here. Together with Jet Maros, his new pupil might visit you. Her name is Snigulochka and she's really pretty. I surely knew about Santa Claus, Jet Maros and stuff but never heard he had some family of himself. Afterwards, I came back to Babushka's home and she made me taste some baranki with tea. While spending this relaxing moment together, she started telling me the story about Kolobok. The story is about this round dove, the grandma cooked, that decided to run away from her. Each time he encountered someone that was willing to eat him, he sang them a song that says I'm a happy Kolobok, crunchy and brown. In the oven I was baked, on the windowsill cooled. From Dedushka I ran away, from Babushka too. I ran away from the rabbit, wolf and bear. And now I'll run away from you. In the end he ran away from everyone but the fox that ended up eating him. So once I had the full belly, 
I finally arrived home. It was surely tasty and the babushka was so kind-hearted, but all that food was really, really too much for me. I felt a bit like the kolabok from the story afterwards. If you want to hear more Russian stories, stuff about food and songs, leave your comment below and tell me your thoughts about it. While, if you want to taste some delicious tea along with the recipes I got from Babushka, please enter to take part of my Discord server, you can find the link in the description. There you can find lots of events during the week, uh, kind moderators, interesting people, you can discuss your hobbies. So check out my Discord server and we can hang out together. Bis